Hi, I'm Lisa. I'm one of the nurses. Tell me what's been going on with your daughter today. My daughter has diabetes and she's been vomiting all day. I didn't give her any insulin. When I checked her glucose, her monitor read critical high. Okay. Um, let me have you put this gown on and then I'll go grab one of the doctors, okay? supervising doctors today. This is Dr. Shirley. He's one of our a resident doctors. Hi, how are you? Um, what's going on? Um, my daughter has diabetes and she wasn't feeling very good yesterday. This morning she started vomiting. Okay. She's vomited eight to ten times already. She didn't give herself insulin okay. and we did check her glucose at red critical Okay, okay. All right, very good. Well, we're going to take a look at her, and then uh, uh, Dr. Shirley will be back with you in just a second, okay? Okay. I'm just putting her on the monitor to get some vital Hi, Chelsea. How are you doing? I'm Dr. Upham. This is Dr. Shirley. It's nice to meet you. Good to meet you. So I heard you, you, you have um, <coughs> type 1 diabetes, is that right? But you weren't taking your insulin? Okay. And you've been throwing up a lot? Okay. All right, very good. Well, we'll put you on the, the monitors here. Okay, so her vital signs are heart rate is 135. Um, oxygen saturation is 98%. Um, her respiratory rate is 28. Look at it. Her blood pressure is 110 over 70, and they weighed her at triage, and she's 50 kilograms. Okay. Do we have a, a glucose here? Uh, let me get that. Okay. So I'm going to start two IVs on you, and I'll get some lab work in the glucose. Okay. okay. Very good. Well, I'm going to take a listen to you while Dr. Shirley uh, talks with your mom a little bit more, okay? All right. Can I have you sit up for a second? You doing okay, ma'am? Mm -hmm. All right. So, as we talked already, you said Chelsea has type 1 diabetes, correct? Okay. Yes. Do you recall kind of what our glucoses were at home yesterday and this morning? Yesterday it was 300. Okay. And this morning it just read critical high. Critical high. Okay. And she's had that before? Have you ever seen the monitor say that? Yes. Okay. When, when have you noticed that? Uh, um, it was about six months ago. Six months ago. Usually her glucose is between 200 and 300. Mm -hmm. She doesn't take always her take her insulin yeah, like she's she supposed to. Yeah, you know, she's a teenager. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, does she have any other health problems? Or has she been in the hospital for anything? Uh, she doesn't have any other problems. She's been in the hospital twice for DK. I see. Okay. So how long ago was that you said? That was six months ago. That was ago. when I said critical high that time. Yeah. Okay. All right. Did she have any allergies or has she ever had surgeries before? No. Okay. Since she started, you know, before you guys came in, have you noticed anything like headaches, um, abdominal pain? Um, has her breathing been any different to you? Um, now she's kind of breathing kind of heavy. When did you know, first start okay. noticing that? Have it over here. Um, it was this morning. Okay. And any fevers? No. Nothing like that? No. Is Just the vomiting. Okay. Yeah. All right then. Um, and you said her glucose is at home yeah. run? It's between 200 and 300. Okay. What's her insulin regimen? Uh, she does blood glucose checks with so meals, snacks, a and at bedtime. Okay. She takes insulin less pro, one okay. unit for every 20 grams of carbs. Her sliding scale is one unit of insulin for every blood glucose 50 over 150. Okay. And her evening dose of insulin glargine is 12 units at 9 o'clock. Okay, all right. And six months ago when she had an episode like similar to this, does it look similar to you or is this something different to you? Yeah, except for the vomiting. The vomiting, so she's having a lot more vomiting this time. Yes. Okay. All right, give me just a few moments, okay? All right, thank you. All right. Dr. Abham, I uh, was talking to the mom and she said that Chelsea's had DKA in the past um, okay. twice. Um, the most recent was six months ago. She said it looks similar to this presentation here, mm -hmm. but the only difference is she's vomiting a lot more this time. Okay. So, anticipating that she might be um, in DKA again with her breathing like this and such, I'd like to get some labs. Sure. Um, let's get a chemistry, uh, Chem 10 with an ionized calcium, uh, a venous blood glucose, a, or blood gas, excuse me, and a urinalysis. And as, would you also dip it when you get the urinalysis yes. as well? Um, and let's get uh, hemoglobin A1C and okay. then a chemistry, I mean a uh, CBC with differential. Okay. Okay, so her glucose came back, it's critically high, okay. which means the monitor can't read it because it's over 600. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Right. So I agree with you. I think she's likely in DKA. She's also um, a little bit dehydrated. She's tachypnic mm -hmm. and tachycardic. I think she could use a liter of fluid and four of Zofran, please, okay. or on Dancitron, rather. Right. Okay. okay. Um, so if we could one one liter of fluid labs, four milligrams of IV on Dancitron. Okay. And um, we need to check on in on our do one hour neuro checks as well. Okay. In the meantime, you're going to be ordering some insulin. And yeah, I, what, I think that, you know, anticipating this is DK, we'll definitely get insulin on board, but before we get that, we'll just come get things together. So I'd like to wait for the venous to come back, um, but we'll be doing 0 0.1 units per kilogram per hour of the insulin drip, so we'll be dripping that, and then fluids will be um, normal saline with 20 milliequivalents of potassium uh, chloride and 20 milliequivalents of potassium phosphate. We also would need a, a separate bag, so a different bag uh, with the dextrose in it, so 10% dextrose and normal saline with uh, 20, uh, 20 milliequivalents of potassium chloride and 20 milliequivalents of potassium phosphate as well. Okay. You guys are used to wanting that together. so Right. Definitely. Okay. So her first IV starter, I just need to do the second one and I'll get that. Okay, okay. Um, and we'll write the orders out. Okay. okay, sounds good. All right. All right.